What it do was cracking. It's your boy Sneaker Sunday. We are back once again with a banger. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, we are unboxing and reviewing the Jordan 12 Reverse Flu Games. Hands down, I want to say the best Jordan 12 since the Flu Games drop. Or maybe the taxis or the reverse taxis. All right, top three. Top three, it goes Flu Game, Reverse Flu Game. And the reverse taxis. My opinion, those are my top three. I say those are the best top three Jordan 12s colorway that's dropped ever. Period. Uh, let's get straight into it. Alright, so let's get straight into it. Got your Jordan 12 paper. Now, the material. Not just the colorway, but as you can see, the material is like that. Raging Bulls 5, if I'm not mistaken. It's not as, let's say, the all red 5. You see where that material is different? Like here, it seems like it's that material. But then on the upper, I feel like they changed it or it's not that great of a material. These are not the Raging Bulls. These are just regular red fives. But as you can see, I'm, yeah, I'm standing up. As you can see, I like this material. I'm hoping that the Raging Bulls fives come out with this material. I really, 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 really like this material. I don't like this material that much. Uh, I don't, it's just, I feel like once it gets wet, it kind of dulls out. Let's see about these. I could be wrong. But as of right now, I think these are the, these are the, these are really good material. This is really good material. They didn't hold back on the material on these. As you can see, there's really no glue stain. Probably zoom in a little. My bad, I'm like congested and shit. But yeah, overall, like you see little glue stains, but I mean, these ain't bad. These are not bad at all. Hot in here. Just got some lights, so I don't know if you guys can see that. If it looks better, let me know in the comments below. But yeah, I'm a little stuffy. But yeah, look at that. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but you see how that changes? That's that soft of butter. <laughs> soft of buttery sway. I think it's sway. But, man, yeah. <laughs> These remind me of my old car. I love black and red combination. I feel like the black and red combo is fire. I think the red, the black shoelaces is fire. People were um, disappointing on the bag lace. I mean, I don't know. I mean, it's just a bag lace. You're not gonna rock the bag, bag lace. My opinion, you know, you're not gonna rock it. So I can care less about how the bag lace comes in or looks like. What I care about is the shoe. I feel like the shoe I mean, it's it's a black and red sneaker. I mean, it looks just like the reverse or the regular flu games. This is what is there not to like about these? It has red and it has black. These are your platinum hit records right here. You got two platinum hit records on one album. Like I don't know, but my opinion, you got the uh, red twenty three, black underneath, red Jumpman, red twenty three. Man, these are dope. And you got your black Jordan shoelace holes. This is feeling soft too. You got your black Jumpman. You got your extra red laces. Like I mentioned before, people were kind of disappointed on the laces. But yeah. I like these a lot. Glad I won the raffle for my local Foot Locker. I didn't have to fight for these. I didn't have to pay resale for these. These are straight retail. Uh, as in resale value. I mean, if you have the capital, I'll hold on. I'll buy. Try to get at retail. Wouldn't get anything above retail right now. I don't see these going up anytime soon. But that's just my opinion. I didn't invest in these in a bigger scale. I actually just bought these for a personal. I thought they were... I thought they were nice enough to get two pairs, to be quite honest with you. I wish the red was the same, but I guess you can't really get that 
because of it being, you know, two different materials. But it is what it is. Other than that, these are pretty nice. I wanted to double up on these. I just chose not to, and I'm gonna regret it. But um, yeah. Uh, okay. See, as you can see there, there's a light little defect, some glue stain, or looks like some. It's not connected. Yeah, looks like it's coming off already. So let's see, see how these hold up. And the video off, and get in front of the camera. Oh, we'll end the video off and we'll get in front of the camera. Actually, no. We'll switch over and we're gonna actually give you guys a um, up close look on these. Put these on the spinning, not the spinning table, but my little, you'll see. <laughs> All right, so here you guys have them. They're on the, um, you know, step stool. My little version of the uh, spinny wheel. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Here you guys have them, a little close-up look. You can probably see that a little better. That nice little butter, and it feels, it feels nice. It feels good. Try to focus in a little. But you see how that changes? I like that. And the material, once you feel these in hand, once you see this in hand, it feels, I know I'm weird. <laughs> but my sneakers gotta feel as good as they look. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, see if you guys can see that. That's pretty dope. Stitching is nice. I mean, the only thing I seen the defect from what I seen that they could have done better is that right there, the glue stain there. And I believe on my left pair, there's a gap forming right there. But um, other than that. These are to me a nine. I I can easily give the, give these a nine. The reason they're not a ten is because of that glue stain. To be honest, that's the only reason they're not a ten. But Jordan, you gotta you gotta keep in mind too. I mean, we're we're still in a pandemic, pandemic, and I mean a lot of these factories and these these places. Excuse me, they had to you know shut down for a long time, especially if they weren't essential businesses. And for Jordan to pump out, I mean, the quality on this is pretty good. These, I know I regret not doubling up. <laughs> I should have got two pairs. I mean, I could probably still get another pair. But, yeah, I probably can. I might double up on these. I think I'm going to double up on these. Because I would want to keep one of these dead stock for a while. And rock the crap out of the other, you know. And this is perfect because the Rage and Bull fives are coming out, so it's like yin and the yang, you know. At least my opinion, you know. But um, yeah. I've uh, been talking, rambling off for too much. <laughs> Let me uh give you guys some looks. I know you guys want to see this up close. There's your black Jordan shoelace holes. Your red Jumpman. Personal size ten. Give you guys one more spin. That's the front. That's the toe. Got your black laces. Also comes with an extra red pair. Yeah. All right. Let's get behind the camera and end the video off. So there you guys have them. The reverse Jordan 12 flu games. Let me know what you guys feel about these. Were these a hit? Were these a pass? Did you guys invest in these? Did you guys cop multiple pairs? Were these easy to cop? Did they sell out in your like around your stores? Let me know. Comment down below. I'm interested to see what you guys feel about these. Uh, and if you like the video, just like, share, comment. Anything helps out. All of that helps out. Since you know I'm a small channel, uh, any feedback or any um, anything helps actually. And um, yeah, give you guys one more spin on these. You guys already know my my personal opinion. I've been rambling off for too long. But yeah. These are dope. I like these. I'm very happy with these. Thank you, Jordan. And I'll see you guys in the next video. We out.